Good morning, cultists. Welcome back to another Unbalanced Breakfast with Cthulhu's. All right, so in the last episode, um, after much, uh, much dawdling and uh, gassing around with inventory and whatnot, we finally got into the vault of Brachus Rex, I think. That's what this place is. I'm not actually sure. Apparently, we have the whole place already explored somehow, which, again, is another mystery. Oh, whoa. Look at this. Hot damn. <gasps> we can filch these portraits and paintings. There's only one. Damn, that we can we better be able to filch all this gold. Otherwise, uh, I'm gonna be pissed. Alright, now where was I? Um Right, okay. So let's I guess explore the rest of this place. Get the crate which has nothing. And this chest, which I'm assuming is cursed or trapped in some way, most likely. All right, gentlemen and ladies, gather around. Let's open this thing up and I'll die. No? Jagged ring? Gold? I think we should give the jagged ring to Losa. Yeah, that's good. Ferosi somehow has the most magical armor of everyone, which is... Nothing short of a miracle. Is there anything we can do about the... Thing here? No, right? I mean... The little, um... I forget what it's called. The barrier thing. I couldn't seem to interact with it at all, and uh, attacking it did nothing. Decorational sword. Oh man, we're stealing all of this, that's for sure. Let's take the landscape. We can't reach it, what the hell? Can we use this? No. We'll take that. The bowl? That's fool's gold. Don't touch that. Take the portrait of the woman. We can't. You see yourself in the mirror. It's quite a sight. Crafting Bible? Oh hell yes. What's this about? What do we gain from this? We learned four new recipes. Um the shocker, which is apparently a uh um a sexual thing that you can do with your partner or partners. I don't know. Ask your parents. And we can also take the plates. I think they're pretty valuable, right? Um, are they? Apparently, they're a... An ingre wait. They're an ingredient? No, let's add them to the wares. Anything else that we need to not really hold on to? Like the painting of the man and whatnot. Painting of Thane Wolfric. Nah, it's garbage. Fool's gold. But it's gold nonetheless. Bottle of wine, we'll take that. Bottle of wine, we'll take that too. Any paintings? Oh yes. Decorational sword. Fantastic. And that too. And also the painting of Blosser. Gregor the Red. Fantastic. Anything else we can loot from this place? No, I think we're good. What about this door? Where does this lead? Uh, it leads nowhere, and it's also cursed. Thank you, um, Trumpdorf, or whatever the hell your name is. Uh, I'm assuming this one is also, um, cursed, so we might as well open it and get it over with. Fantastic. You could, you thought you could hurt us with a little bit of poisoning? I don't think so, punk nugget. What's up here? Now I'm assuming these chests are trapped, maybe? Let's do it. Let's quick save, and figure out... Yep, there we go. Hey, we got this one though. Mage's leggings? Losa? Losa? And armor frost scroll. We'll give that to Losa as well. Losa, take a look at the uh, mage's leggings and see if you can actually make good use of them. Yeah, seems like it. Wow, wow, we wa. Oh, yes. Always happy to see some skin. Um, Fane. Yeah, the same. Never mind. Alright. It's auto sort. And I think. Wait, we need to give someone a chipped ring. Who here has the least amount of. Okay, it's uh, Sabil then. Sabil, why don't you take the chipped ring, add to your magical armor a little bit. And I think we can go out this way, maybe. It's locked. 
Can we open this one? It's probably a trap, isn't it? Yeah, that's what I thought. Guys, anyone see a key or anything? Do we interact with a statue? You come to search, but you won't find the way. A pity. Um. Suggest that if it helps you, you just might. Ask how the statue can be so certain. Brachus has willed it. Trump Noe must abide. You have met the unfortunate guardian of this vault. Oh. Confirm its suspicion. You have you've had the displeasure. Judge him with a forgiving heart. Fate has been unkind to him. <sighs> do you wish to move forward? Say you do. Listen closely and make your attempt. Listen, answer me these question three. Ere the other side of the bridge you see. Bracus is a bloody, rotten, thieving, very, very awful fellow. Some even call him a cur. A cur is... Very awful, rotten, rotten, bloody awful, very bloody awful. What? Bracus is a bloody, rotten, thieving, very, very awful... Oh! Oh! I just remembered something. The rat said it's all about the letters. The letters, look. Bloody, rotten, okay, thieving, that doesn't really work with, with the A, but CC, very, very awful fellow. Okay, so, um, you, B corresponds to uh, bloody, R corresponds to rotten, A is thieving, C is very, and U is awful, and S is fellow. So C would be very, Awful, rotten, very awful, rotten. Either you're very good at guessing or the slightest bit clever. Let's find out for certain. Okay. Listen closely and make your attempt. I can't believe I actually got that right. <laughs> Holy crap. Source is a scourge, a devil, a misery, a blight, a hex, a curse. And yet, the cure is... I'm assuming this follows the same pattern as it did with the first uh, the question. Source is a scourge, a devil, misery, blight, a hex, a curse. And yet the cure is... A band? No? Um, the cure is... A hex? A... Uh... A hex? A misery? Yeah, a hex, a misery, a blight, a curse. Yes. Perhaps you're not totally incapable after all. Or maybe Trompdoy told you the answers, is that it? Is he hoping you'll... It doesn't matter in any case. The path is opened. Go freely. Yes, I can't believe I actually got the questions right. Oh my god, I'm so good! Oh! -ho! So you'd like to ask them further questions. I know little. But you have proven yourself a knowing traveler. I will answer what I can. Refer to a second riddle and ask what he meant by the cure to source. Brachus Rex discovered the way. This he researched here, upon this isle. He could remove the source from any creature or individual. I saw the stars he used myself. They were most impressive. Ask what he meant by... Sorry, ask what he meant when he said Tromptoy was kept here by Brachus Rex. Brachus Rex has charged him, tried him, convicted and punished him. I know not the crime, but he has been sentenced to remain in this vault for all time and to prevent others from entering. Mm -hmm. Trump Doy was and is a creative man. He knew petty magic in his day, but this he has used to carve this place out from a simple vault, myself included. Okay, so you're Trump Doy's creation, really? That's giving him a lot of credit. Can I move this thing? Not enough strength. Are you sure about that? I just really want to reach that uh, portrait of the woman, so that I can uh, filch it. I'm assuming it's going to be another invisible... There you go. That's what I thought. Now what about up there? Same thing. Oh, jeez. Where the shit... Oh my god. What the crapola. Okay. Sabil? Let's have you go behind him. That's gonna take zero AP, fantastic, and now lay it on his dick. In a non-sexual way. No, we don't want to give him the pleasure. Ah, oh, jeez, what is that? Chameleon Cloak. I'm assuming he's making his way over that way. Herbrosi? Do it. Unleash your justice upon his face. In a sexual way. 
Ah, oh, jeez. Crap. Can we get over there from here, or... Oh, we can. I see. Okay, that's good, 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 good. And we can go up to that guy, but I think... Let's focus our efforts on the people that we can see. Actually, we can get this guy too. We might as well, and then slow down their progress. Alright, so let's get that guy uh, lit up. Let's get him lit up. And I think that'll affect Fabrosi as well, so we'll just... Say the, uh, say, uh, send the last one to him too. Oh, jeez. Hope these aren't tough fights. But we are a level higher than they are, so at least we got that going for us. Alright, Losa? Mmm, maybe we'll teleport this Tromptoy over to here. That way, Sibyl and uh, Fabrosi can uh, work him over. Fortunately, we didn't really get the hit on the other guy, but that's fine. Eat shit, Tromptoy. Alright, he's actually... Whoa, we stripped him of his magical armor completely. Oh no. Wait, it affected both of them? How the shit did that happen? What the crap? Or we could actually... Do either of these punks. Let's go for the guy with the, um... With less, uh, physical armor. Wait. Oh, he's over there. Aha! <laughs> oh no, we didn't need to, uh... Be smart about it. Damn. Let's put up the fire. Alright, um... They still have physical armor. At least this guy still does. So let's give Fane... Or no, yeah, let's, Losa's more hurt. Let's give... I'm thinking he's probably going to be going after Fane. I don't know how he managed to hit both Losa and uh, Fane with that one uh, thing. But let's try to strip this guy of his armor a little bit more. Okay, do your best, punk. But we can still reach you. Oh crap, Losa's not looking so good. Tromptoy? Let's do that. I think it might have been a... We should have, um... Given Fane a better weapon. Because I think he's a little, uh... Bottlenecked a little bit. If that makes any sense. Why don't you heal yourself a little bit, Losa? And then try to get this asshole... Let's put this bitch on ice. Perfect. Oh, and now he's out of their hair. Great. What the... What does that accomplish? That was a tr that was really stupid, but... Thank you. Alright, um... Sabil, I'm actually gonna have you go after him. There you go. And I suppose we can... Let's put him to sleep. If it's even possible, that is. And it is! Look at that. Tactical retreat? Damn. Oh, shit. Good combo there, guys. Good combo. Thankfully, uh, Fabrosi is still relatively... You know, actually, he's completely full up on his, uh... Um, what's it? Thing there, so... Uh, magical armor, so we're fine. This guy has a lot of, uh, physical... Um, sh shield. Crap. Do they all have, like, the same skill? I'm assuming not. What if we ignite? It's not going to affect everyone. Uh, but let's give it a try. What the fuck? That did nothing. What the crapola? I don't understand. But let's... Shit burglar. Damn it. We're in a terrible position. Let's put you up here. Fabrosi, keep at it. You're doing well so far. Actually, it's kind of weird to say, but I think Fabrosi is so far the most useful of our team. Which is really bizarre. But it is the way it is. Okay, we need to kill this guy with magical uh, stuff. And... Target is too far. No, he's not. He can just finagle it. No, he can't. Dang, nabbit. 
First aid, in, uh, he heals, and it also gets rid of uh, some status effect stuff. How about then you just get in here and lay it on him? That's not a lot. We should try to focus on someone who's a little bit more close to dying, like this guy. But unfortunately, our backlash is still... Ah, I, f I f keep forgetting to teach... Get to be able to read those books on um, scoundrel skills. Damn it. I'm the worst. Right, can we actually maybe... No, he's going to be able to get a hit on us. Not that it's a bad thing. Okay, fine. Let's do this then. Okay. Losa's still doing alright for the most part. She's a little... She's... Yeah, she's starting to look a little bad. But you know what? I think for the most part we're okay still. And he seems to have lost his ghost effect? Just a little weird. Um... I think we're actually fairly close to killing him. So let's focus our efforts on this chump. There we go. Perfect. That's one ass nugget done. Sibyl is doing alright. Losa, we might need you to heal up a little bit. No, he's still got regeneration. I think we're fine. Let's try to get this guy killed next. Perfect. And then, there were two. Let's go after him. Because they don't want to shock our own, uh, own people here. Not that I think it's, you know... Wait, really? How's... What? I don't understand. Okay, obviously you're going to take an attack of opportunity, which is not great. So how about you just, um... Keep shiving this bitch. Shiva bitch! Almost dead. Not quite. Just 3 HP away. Are you kidding me? Damn. Fane, you okay there, buddy? He's alright. He's a big boy. Alright, for Brosi. Good job. Now let's end this bitch. Right here. Right now. Fane? I guess he might as well get uh, started uh, by chipping away on his health. But maybe do a little bit of this first. Perfect. And then now, keep at it, buddy. Losa? Staff of Magus, this guy. And... Sure, Hail Strike. What the crap was that? That was nowhere near anything. That was atrocious. Now can you get behind him? Perfect. Stab his dick. Not that I think he really has one right now. And we might as well put him to sleep a little bit more, right? Just to skip his uh, next turn. There we go. Whoa, no! What the shit burglar? Oh, crap. I wonder if this guy's the main illusion guy, though. Because if you can kill the main illusion guy, then that's like... Well, at least according to the law of RPGs. Then that means the, the rest of the other dudes will also disappear. So let's try to focus on him, for the most part, I think. Uh, Fane, can you do anything to... Expedite this process somewhat? Not quite. Yeah, Fane also has some very limited skills, which is not great. Let's yeah, do that, and then let's teleport him exactly where he stands and hope that doesn't crush Fabrosi. Nope, we're fine. Oh, jeez. What now? Crap, what is this? Oh, psh. Whatever, man. Oh, shit. Now Fane is frozen somehow. I don't understand. I don't think so, punk. Wait. If we kill these guys, do we get... Oh, no. Damn. If we kill these guys, though, do we get extra experience points? Because maybe it'd be worth it to farm experience points then. I don't know. 
And I'm gonna see if... Ah, oh, shit. Damn. Right, well, I know for a fact that this can backstab. Good job. Damn, one HP, really? That's been like the, um... The thing for this entire fight. Dude's left like one HP and shit. Oh, we did it! I was right! We killed the main guy and that, um, de-summoned the other dudes. And I guess I could tell because he didn't have an illusion thing on him. Maybe that's how I was supposed to tell? Uh, <laughs> Trump Toy's hatchet, which is basically just a cleaver. Fantastic. Wits? Not that useful. Band of Brachus Rex. Set cursed. Cold to the touch, this ornate ring once belonged to Brachus Rex. Within the band is inscribed... Within the band is inscribed the name Cassandra, the soul forged twin he turned into an undead lich. Lich, not lich. The f I mean, I looked it up. And I looked at the etymology of the word and whatnot. And it is actually supposed to be pronounced lich, not lich. I'm still really salty about that. Anyways, uh, indistinct malevolent whispers issue from the stone. So is it basically the one ring? You feel a cold, dark pain shoot up through the bones of your arm. Your mind itches. Yeah, it's the one ring. You don't hear, but feel a whisper in the cavity that functions as your ear. It tells you to slip the ring onto your finger. <laughs> nice. I, I I really like how they accounted for the fact that um, Ferrosi's, you know, undead. And he doesn't actually have ears. Alright, let's give the um, Thunderbolt Grenade to, uh, um, what's her face? And Losa? Sorry, Sibyl, can you learn these? Fan-fucking-tastic. Holy shit. I'm sorry that took way too long, guys. I'm sure you were, like, super frustrated by the fact that I was just, like, completely forgetting to uh, get her new skills and shit. And Pyrokinetic and Polymorph. Maybe we should get Fane Polymorph. That could be really cool, right? Because, you know, he's already got the uh, face uh, morphing thing. Can we face rip this bitch? We can't. Well, that's really unfortunate. Okay, fine. Uh, what was I doing? Sabiu, just gonna make sure that you have your proper skill set. And let's also move this out of the way. Let's put the first aid near the back. Yeah. Um, adrenaline also near the back because it's not really an offensive skill. Flurry will put closer to the back as well. There we go. We got Scoundrel and then we got Flurry and then Adrenaline and First Aid. Great. Um, and you're not using your memory, memory slots for anything useless, are you? No, I think we're fine. Mm, Losa is criminally underusing her uh, memory, as is Fane. Damn. Okay. We just need to find more skills for these dudes. There's nothing up there, I don't think. For Brosi, I said there's nothing up there. Alright, let's have you guys move on down here. And I can actually see the, uh, the bridge, quote-unquote, I guess. The bridge, um, from the mini-map. Which is... Kind of, I guess? Cheaty? But, I mean, not really, because you can just... Figure out exactly where they are anyways. And besides, it's not like you can click off the bridge. Doesn't really matter. Alright, we're good. Okay. Here we are. In the treasury. Can we... Ah, oh, gold pile. What? This gold pile is empty. And this is comically large gold coins, and they're stacked perfectly. Like someone went out of their way to stack them perfectly or something. Like whoever stacked them should definitely be playing Jenga, or at least setting up Jenga sessions. Good grief. And the size of these gold coins? There's no way that these aren't chocolate gold coins, and that's a symbol of chaos. Or the um, international symbol of the um, nine-pronged anus? Or the eight-pronged anus. Fantastic. Necromancer Gwix Soul Jar. Okay, those, those are the soul jars that they wanted us to take. Heart of the Tyrant Gratiana Soul Jar. Mikal Zoldak. 
small venom rune. You made it all this way. Whoa. Um, ask him why he was so intent on keeping you out. He trembles and seems to shudder with a quiet sob. I'm cursed, you know. Bloody Bracus bound me here to protect his vault. He has my soul in that jar just there. And I can't leave without it. As long as the jar stays unbroken, I can never truly die. Mm, ask what he did to earn such a punishment. I don't rightly know. This was the Source King's way. Befriend you, then destroy you. I was a fool to expect I'd be an exception. His favor was intoxicating. That's no excuse, but it is the reason. <sighs> Should we help him? Agree to help him and break his soul jar. Tell him he's an insufferable rat of a man and deserves his fate. I don't know. Man. What do we do? Ah, jeez. Um. I kind of want to break it. Mostly because, uh. I think that we would get more experience points by freeing him. But I also don't fucking like this jerk. So I'm kind of tempted to just leave him as is. I don't think um, these are. I don't think his soul jar is part of the quest to retrieve the soul jars. So I think we're fine. Ah, Gratiana, that's why she's still here. That's why she had the um, really weird storied past or whatever. <sighs> All right. Let's agree to help him and break his soul jar. Really? You... You would? Uh, maybe we, we could say psych and then say no? He drops to his knees before you and grabs onto your feet with both hands, head hanging. Thank you. Okay. Whoa! I think we did something right. Maybe? The dag. The fortifying... Oh my god, this was made for Fabrosi. Holy shit, I really wish we could take a couple. Because this would be really nice for uh, uh, Sabil. The dag, I think, would be... Oh man, this would be perfect for Fane. Dang, nabbit. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew. I knew we would get something that was better. Uh, or, I mean, it's not better, but the constitution... No, I'm such an idiot. Oh, I spent all that money. Really wish I could get all of, all of these. Damn it. Don't worry, Fane. We'll get you better gear soon enough. Yeah. The barrier. Holy shit, Fabrosi. Looking spiffy, man. Looking spiffy. Mm, what is perseverance? Exactly. Perseverance restores magic armor after you recover from frozen or stunned and restores physical armor if knocked down or petrified. Okay. What about retribution? Retribution reflects received damage to your attacker. Aha. Uh -huh. Plus five to accuracy, plus five to dodging. Mm. This is more offensive, I think, because it increases our single handed. As well as... Well, look. If we get the bonus to single-handed, it actually increases our accuracy. So that plus 5 to accuracy is basically negated. Which means that the uh, benefits do somewhat slightly outweigh um, what we would lose from having this instead. I do kind of like the look of that. But... Mm, dodging. That's pretty handy. Perseverance, I feel like might be a little better than, but the constitution, 9 HP, which isn't a lot. I don't know, maybe we'll just keep on, keep the nap for now, and then perhaps later we'll switch on to the uh, barrier or something. I don't know, we'll see. Also, uh, let's go ahead and loot the ornate chest. Hail strike, which we already have, thank you very much. 
Uh, yeah, sure, let's take that. Unidentified gloves. Can someone please identify? Grasping gloves. Oh, hell yes. Sibyl, for you, my lady. And let's give this to a Fane. Sibyl, you can take the grasping gloves now. Reduces your finesse, though. So that's not great. Wait, that's this. Um, But it does increase your critical chance, which is kind of awesome. But wait. Mm, no, that's just weapon damage. And it also gives you fortify, which is pretty handy. Second skin. Mm. No, it, it also gives you more armor and whatnot, so I think it's fine. That's fine. Alright, uh, what else did we pick up? We picked up the Sash, which is physical armor. Does anyone not- like, I like the constitution that we get from this and the initiative boost too. I guess uh, Losa doesn't have a- okay, Fane doesn't have one either. Between you two, Losa needs the physical armor. That's fine. The Band of Brachus, let's not wear that just yet. I think we should probably look into the curse. And find out if there's a way to get rid of said curse before we can, uh, before we don that thing and, um, submit our soul to Sauron. I mean, Brachus Rex. Um, Heart of the Tyrant, Supernova Skill, Pyrokinetic. Fane, this one's made for you, my friend. Babrosi, go ahead, take the, no, the Heart of the Tyrant. This isn't cursed, is it? Ah, dang. It's been cursed. Oh no. Oh sweet Jesus. Wait. Uh, it's been cursed. So does it actually kill me? I have no idea. Oh no, it does kill me. Never mind. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> ah jeez. Alright, let's take the purging wand. Look at that wand. It hums with inner sauce. With inner sauce. I keep hearing sauce every time they mention source. Uh, can I get rid of... In a, there we go, thank you. Eternal Worshipper. Uh, Artifacts of the Tyrant. No, that's not it. The Eternal Worshipper? Uh, Soul Jar of Gratiana. Ah, right, she's asking us to get these. So, do we bring them back to her, or what's a dealio here? The Soul Jar stands on its plinth, glowing softly. From within, you can almost hear the whisper of a voice. Let's leave the jar alone for now. Um, why don't we decide what to do with all this stuff in the next episode? Yeah, I think that might be a good idea. I feel like it would uh, kind of drag on for a little bit longer than I uh, really uh, wanted to. Alright, so for now, thanks for watching and have a good breakfast.